ears open for a better day. There he is. Good to see you again, Uncle. So, Molly ain't around? No, not for a while now. You boys sure returned with a bang. And we always seem to these days. White to B4, black to F5, white to G3, knight to F6, bishop to G2, black to G6, knight to F3, white to D4, black to F5. You okay there? Working it all out. Once and for all, Arthur. Hmm. What now? We're back, and I'm sitting here, and I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily enactors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well, I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my, my final move, but... I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. What about the women? You sound like Hosea. I miss him. I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we going to run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we there just... is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek, I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you take folks up that away. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I ain't got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. Charles, be right with me. Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's a brute country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while you boys were away. And? Mm. You'll see. I know the way. Follow me. Come on, girl. We need to get this done fast. Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah, the sooner we get out of here, the better. It's quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? Yeah, a boat's probably a good idea. 
Okay, good. It's good to see you again, Charles. You too. Thanks for what you did in San Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Hosea. You did good getting the others out of there, keeping everyone together. Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't in addition to yours. Huh. Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. And where did you end up again? Cuba? Oh, uh, not exactly. An island off of there called Guarma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh, I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Anyway, I ain't always sure Dutch knows what he wants anymore. Perhaps not, but he's always managed to figure things out in the past. I know. Hey, you're right. So just... It's been... Uh, guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know? Of course. There's the bridge. There should be some canoes down to the right here. Well, I see one anyway, and that'll do. Come on. <clears throat> okay, Butcher Creek is a few miles upriver. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into Rain's Fall and Eagle Flies. The Indians? And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. That's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble and heading into more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. And we're gonna need to be careful. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Great! Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here, it's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near, even the law. But just be ready. It won't be pretty. So be it. That's Butcher Creek up ahead. Who are they? The locals. Well, they don't look too friendly. Wait till you meet the Murphys. All right, let's walk it from here. Good evening.
These Murphy Hills, stranger, might watch where you wander. It's a bit of a walk. We could grab those horses if you want. We probably won't miss them if we get them back by morning. Okay. Folks don't want to come around here. They ain't exactly a welcoming place. Lots of stories of people going missing around these parts. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Guess that's good for us. Assuming these inbred bastards are willing to part with their home, which I'm sure they won't be too pleased about. No, but I believe they hide out all over Roanoke Ridge. These caves are just one of their spots. Which is why we should keep it down. They might have lookouts around. Okay. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Watch it. Follow me, stay quiet. Let's get closer to him. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I said we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Why do I always gotta do the carrying? Because I do the skinning. Well, Quick, Arthur. Then who do the carrying? Good job. We must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Stagecoach went missing. Jesus. They must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What you think? We can head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Let's surprise them in there. Okay. Let's get a little closer. Ready? Let's get this over with. You see that? Someone's coming out of the cave. I'll keep watch. You deal with that one in the entrance. Quietly. Another one up ahead. Are you 
you take me in? Okay, let's move. Lucky tone then, Charles! Let's get that poor girl out of the cage. Stay away from me. We ain't gonna hurt you. Don't touch me. It's okay, miss. Just calm down. Where are you from? Antisburg. What do we do with her? Take her there and I'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Antisburg, right? Yes. Um, it's okay, miss. The others, they... They killed them. You're safe now. Just... Try to breathe. They're animals? I know. Yeah. <laughs> it's all right, miss. Why would... Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I haven't slept in days. <laughs> I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. <laughs> Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. 
Where in Annisburg? One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Just try to relax now. Yeah. Just head for the main street. It'll be easier to walk from there. Go! Come on! Yes. Oh. Here. Oh. Thank God. Which place is yours? Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Come on, man. Ma! Ma! Meredith! She's alive! Oh, she's alive! She saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, ma'am. Murphy Brood got Oh, my darling. How did you manage to... Oh, I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. No, oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just... Keep her warm and keep her safe. <sighs> this is death. Oh no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Thanks, buddy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. I took her home. Oh. You and Micah find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dodge! Did you miss me? I found her drunk as Saint Denise. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and are you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, all my Calm down. I won't be ignored. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. Or any of your stooges. Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing. Miss. I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Okay. I'll spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry? Yeah, I told him, and I tell him again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who what? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard. Go on, She's shoot me. Crazy. She ain't worth it. You told on <laughs> oh, me. You're you not betrayed so now, me. Why? Right. Calm down. Arthur? <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You are not so big now. Are we, Your Majesty? You. Damn. <sighs> she knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. All right. Get back to work. Yeah.
You're a nasty woman, Miss Crenshaw. A nasty woman. You think I wanted to shoot her? You seem to hey. like it. I saw that beady look in your eye. You're drunk again. And you're a fucking murderer. Ah, I wrote the rules. She did no such thing. She was in love. You sour faced Good morning. old crow. God damn you. Murderer! Murderer! I did what I had to do, Mr. Morgan. Perhaps. You okay? What is happening to us? Okay, I'll catch you later then. We'll just soldier on, I guess. You okay? I guess. I didn't really know Molly so well. Thanks for your help. Well, securing this lovely spot. You okay, Tilly? Molly got what she deserved. Nearly got us all killed. <sighs> yep. You knew the rules. So, here we are. Can't believe that bitch Molly ratted us out. Yeah, if she even did. Things are gonna be okay, Jack. Can I go play in the caves? No. I ain't safe in there. How are you coping with all this? Hey, get up. But he What's going on? I've forgotten what it was yeah, now. Quit with the rocket. I'm tired. You okay, Reverend? Yes. I will say a prayer for Miss O'Shea. Say a prayer for all of us. Listen to me. All of you. Listen. We're here. And we are safe now. And that is the main. Hey. Hope you're feeling okay, Morgan. For sure. Listen to me. You have got to keep faith. You've got to. Now, I know. I know. I miss Jose. I surely do. I miss every man and every woman who fell. I do. And I would die in their place gladly if I could. This world is unkind. But it won't break me. Not while I have you by my side. We get some money and we can still They won't catch me. They won't catch me. And I promise whosoever stands by my side they won't catch you neither. They won't. You going to get up? You were snoring, that's all.